welcome back from that short commercial break. And now the vibration and the sounds that you're going to hear are going to bring you back to the memories that we all hold within us, within our DNA, within our eternal memories. Athena's star seed will take us on that journey. And with that, star system, thank you for coming. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. First of all, thanks for showing up for our soul appointment because I feel like we're all here intentionally connecting to each other for a very specific reason. And when we bump into each other's light, we expand. Um, I would love to invite you guys to come closer so I can feel you. So can you all kind of come in this little area up here? Because I want to be with you. So like the first couple rows so that we're together because I want you to be able to sing with me and feel this vibration. So um, my name is Athena Starseed. I was born Tina Renee Castaldi. And uh, ever since I was five, I felt like I was talking to the stars. I don't know if anybody had that feeling that you look up at the night sky and you felt an overwhelming connection. So usually I start out in prayer. So I want to ask you to kind of close your eyes. Take a deep breath, go on the inside. So my name is Athena Starseed. I am born of a billion burning suns. I am the sister to all nations. I am the mother of reverence, and I am the daughter of the great Father God, as we all are. As you sit inside the center of your soul, I want to ask you to take a nice deep breath. Inhale, and exhale. And inhale, and exhale. Imagine four huge 30 foot archangels holding the four directions.
share your compassion and grace with our sin and Archangel Uriel sacred geometry you connect us to So the Mother Earth wants our attention and she wants our intention and our focus on love. The last time we had an earthquake in LA, I was singing to the mother and I went out and I held a tree and I said, Mama, I'm sorry for all that we've done to you. I apologize for the skies, and I apologize for the water, and I apologize for the fracking. And I just want you to know that we, the beings of Earth in this present moment, stand in 100% responsibility for all of it. And I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. I love you. How many of you know the Ho'oponopono? 